Hey, how's it going guys? Um, this is my video on 5-Hour Energy. How it's been causing deaths and causing people to be hospitalized. Uh, it's caused people to have medical conditions, so on and so forth. Um, I would like to go over why that might be. And the problem with 5-Hour Energy. The problem with the actual product uh, and the actual label. Um, I mean, if if I was a lawyer, if I if I was experiencing problems with this product, I could easily sue the company, and I'll tell you how. Um, first off, um, I don't think I'm gonna buy any more Power Energy. <laughs> Two bottles, sit after these are done. I think I'm done using it because of so much cap because of how much caffeine it has in it. I can't really drink coffee or anything after using this product. Um, but the most important part is. Uh, the reason why they're being sued and the reason why it's causing deaths. So let's go straight to the label. Uh, it doesn't have a warning label, it has a caution label. In the caution label, uh, it says that it has caffeine equivalent to a, cups, uh, a cup of coffee. And it says you shouldn't take it if you're nursing or pregnant under the age of 12. Or if you have a medical condition. It doesn't state which medical condition. Um, I don't think anyone's going to go to their doctor and ask, hey, can I use 5-Hour Energy? Uh, I've almost like 80% of products out there say consult a doctor before use. I mean, if everyone who was using those products were consulting a doctor, I would think there would be a huge-ass line outside of every single medical center uh, filled with people asking um, about these products and labels. But here is the problem 5 Hour Energy. Here's the good stuff. Don't want to hold you guys up. In the label, even in the supplement facts, it doesn't say how much caffeine it has whatsoever. I mean, it says it's equivalent to a cup, cup of coffee. Okay, we could have a huge-ass cup of coffee that has 20,000, not 20,000, 2,000 grams of caffeine in it. Or we could have a small, tiny bit of, like, we could have a small cup of coffee that has barely any caffeine in it, okay? It doesn't state how much caffeine is in the product. It says the recommended dosage is half the bottle. Uh, to get the full recommended dosage, take the entire bottle. This is just a normal 500 energy. It's not the extra st strength. I don't think anyone should take the extra strength to begin with of all the risks that comes with it um let me just double check the label but i'm a hundred percent positive that nowhere nowhere in the label it says how much caffeine it has in it yes it just says that it has water uh, artificial flavors potassium sodium um vitamin b12 energy blend uh vitamin b6 Neocene, uh, that's it. And in the back, I already read the label. Um, the recommended use is just take one, one to one and a half bottles energy. Um, yeah, it doesn't say how much caffeine it has in it. Uh, the only thing it says, um, do not exceed two bottles daily. Consume several hours apart. Use or discard. Um, use or discard after opening. Refrigerate. Not required. Yeah, it doesn't say how much caffeine is in this product. Okay, so I could drink the whole bottle because it says that you could drink the whole bottle, and I could go and go out and have an energy drink and have a heart attack, and I could easily sue this product. Because it does not say how much caffeine is in it, okay? Nowhere, nowhere on this product does it say that it contains this amount of caffeine or um, whatnot. That is a problem, 5-Hour Energy. That is why a lot of people who are suing it because of lost family members or because of faced medical conditions, whatever, uh, they are going to win. Um, because, of the mislab mis because of the misleading label, um, because the label is not clear enough, Nowhere does it say it has this amount of uh, caffeine in the product. Uh, do not exceed this amount of caffeine um, for a daily usage. Um, it does not say 
anything about that. It just says four calories, sugar free, hours of energy, no crash. That's it. Um, I had to go online uh, just to find how much caffeine is in this product. That is a problem, okay? <laughs> the person who made this, they need to take uh, every single... They need to stop shipping this product immediately. Uh, they need to encourage people who are, um, who are selling this product to stop doing so immediately and, and to return, pro return the product for a refund. And they need to make a whole new uh, shipping label or they need to make a whole new uh, caution label with how much caffeine is in it and also stating do not exceed this amount of caffeine on a daily use a daily basis okay um, if they do if they have done that then um, if you would have gotten medical conditions or, or god forbid died because of using this product that would have solely been your liability because they clearly state on the on the label um, about the the um, the dangers of this product so, yeah, got two bottles. After these are done, I'm done using this product because of um, how greedy the company is who made it and how misleading the label is and whatnot. They just want, this is what they want to advertise. They just want to advertise hours of energy, no crash later, sugar-free and four calories. That's all they care about. They want to put that out there and make you buy this product. Um, that is a problem, okay, that is, that is driven by greed, and it is misleading and corrupt, okay, that is not an ethical way to sell your product, you should also warn about the dangers, uh, just as much as you should, as you would promote the, uh, benefits of the product, they clearly don't do it, they deserve what's coming, they deserve all the negative um, coverage that they have been getting. Um, I don't feel any pity for the people who work for Five Hour Energy or people who um, uh, support this product because it is unethical. Okay, it is absolutely unethical to sell a product without warning, uh, without warning about the dangers, how much caffeine is in it, because. Because people are dying because of the caffeine. They're having heart attacks because of the caffeine. And that is a problem. All right. My opinion on 5-Hour Energy, you can have yours. Um, but my opinion is firm unless someone, someone leaves a comment. Uh, clarifying um, the details about 5-Hour Energy and what they're doing and whatnot. But not buying it. Not going to buy it anymore. Not going to support anything that has to do with five hour energy. All right, that was that video. Hope you guys had a, um, hope you guys enjoyed it or learned something or it motivated you guys to not purchase this product as well. All right, have a nice day.